and never have we ever walked out of a place. And yeah. I'm not I'm not even gonna mention the name and what yeah. happened. Yeah. Bottom line, it did this is how the day has gone. <laughs> That's actually my Toledo flight. Delta, great prices. $96 round trip from Denver to Detroit. Detroit Rock City. That's what I'm talking about. Oh man, and no, sorry Delta, I did not buy uh, insurance on the flight for $30 on a $96 flight. That was amazing. Okay, I'm off to a camera shop. I'm trying to do better at supporting Local business, local camera shops, you know, it's so easy to, I buy 90% of my camera gear off of, you know, B&H, Autorama, Facebook Marketplace, Craigslist. I like to buy used camera gear all the time. Uh, you know, I break stuff and things wear out, batteries, memory cards, but when I have a chance, so that's where we're off to, we're gonna go to a camera shop then toward the mountains, it did not snow last night. Good news, it is supposed to snow again tonight. Just like one to four inches, but we'll see if, you know, we'll see if it actually sticks to the roads. Uh, what else, what else? Oh yeah, oh my, this makes me, oh, I don't wanna say it makes me sad, but it's, or disappointed, but I'm just like, oh. So here's the deal, remember yesterday, the embargo shoe, it's under embargo. I'm not supposed to talk about it or show, you know, show you pictures or video. So therefore, this shoe, I cannot show you on screen right now, which is crazy because I understand embargo dates for the sake of marketing for different companies, but at the same time, you guys know how I do running blogs and I like to film how I'm, you know, on YouTube, I'm a storyteller. So I like to show, not just talk about uh, you know, the whole process of getting ready for a run, doing the actual, you know, lacing up, deciding on the shoe, you know, warming up, going on the run. Anyway, I film a lot. Therefore, I can't film that shoe and show it on screen for like, I think it's another week until the embargo is up. Therefore, today, I decided to pivot from the embargo shoe, sadly, to, yes, the Alpha Fly, okay, why? Because I wanna compare, I haven't ran in the uh, Alpha Fly in about a year. It feels, I think it was, a, a, I think it was about a year ago, and I wanna compare this to the Nike Next Percent 2 soon in a running shoe battle. So it's just so sad that I'm opting for the Alpha Fly over the embargo shoe simply because, you know, they don't want it to show up on screen. Aha. It breaks my heart. It just breaks my heart. But that's reality. Onward and upward. Yeah, we had some adapters that we could we were selling, you know, so people could adapt the EF glass to it. Uh, yeah. But we don't have any of the lenses for it. Canning stuff has just been kind of hard to get in general. And you don't sell these cam kind of cameras. Um, we know we have we have one. You have one. Oh, I see yeah. it there. Um, but we don't. It's not like the number one selling you know mirrorless camera we sell. Um, we kind of stick to the more normal mounts like the the RF. The or R, R guy. Or this the guy. EF. Yeah, exactly. So, how much is that one again? You can't say I didn't try. You can't say, it. oh man, nope, no luck. They, oh goodness, I've got so many thoughts about retail and business and how to run a successful business. Is it, is it buffalo season? Buffalo season. Buffalo season.
Sometimes we have to pivot. I went to Morrison, Colorado first just to check out a new road up there that I've never... So I go to Morrison to run the trails mostly. Beautiful place to run trails. But I wanted a little stretch of road that was fairly flat anyway. Didn't end up finding one. I thought it was flatter than it was. Stick to what you know is the bottom line. I decided to pivot down here back to the Platte River Trail. Kind of my go-to spot for... Uh, threshold runs, tempo runs, even to a certain extent long runs. So uh, we're going to get ready, put on, yes, the Alpha Flies, and I'm going to do a three mile warm up, do the mini threshold, four miles, okay, nothing crazy, out and back, come back to the car, and then uh, finish off with some more volume, depending on how the legs feel after, probably another 10, again, depending on how the legs feel. Let's go. Oh, oh my goodness. Oh. 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 I'm sorry. Uh-uh. It didn't work out, everybody. <laughs> Sometimes the workouts just don't work out. Oh man, stomach issues. I still ran pretty good. But, as you can see outside, so much for the snow showing up at 5 p.m. No, no, no. It's like 2 p.m. And uh, it's coming down already. So, didn't do the threshold. Basically just tried to survive out there. Oh, man. Oh, that happens. It doesn't happen too often. It's probably like once every three months where the stomach wins and the weather wins. I really try to be conscious of what's happening around me with respect to the weather, and ah, oh, I tried. Ah. Mm. But we keep fighting. We still got a little work in. We got a decent amount of work in. I'll just put it on the screen right now. Why not? There's the work for the day. That's a good day. Nothing to be complain about. You still got out the door. You laced up those shoes. You didn't show embargoed shoes that aren't allowed to be shown. <laughs> and you keep marching on. You know, that's the beauty. Oh, that's the beauty of distance running. It's cumulative. It's big picture. It's aerobic development over years. And frankly, decades, but especially years. <sighs> don't, don't be hard on yourself. Do not be hard on yourself. You hear me? One, one bad run a week, three bad runs a week. If you're still getting out the door, it's good. It's good. You're sweating. Your blood is pumping. You're breathing. Your lungs are filling up with air. You're disconnecting from media. Oh. And of course, I didn't bring the GoPro because I was planning to film. After, I, I, I'm not, I'm done. I'm going home. I'm freezing. I'm going home. Oh, DGR strong. Come on. Come on. Now I just got to find, find my key. Where's my key? Oh, yeah. Oh. Sometimes I got to rant too. Sometimes I got to do, just do a little, do a little riffing. A little riffing on YouTube. Oh. I love you guys. Come on. It's okay. It's okay. Don't be hard on yourself. Just keep working. Keep working. Uh. Back home, it's been a little while since we've done a mail time. If you have sent a package, thank you for your patience. We're gonna start at the top and work our way down in no particular order. Here we go, shout out to John G, spelled J-A-N-J-I, okay? J, I love this company. Uh, some of the most comfortable running shorts I own, but also some of the most comfortable 
uh, workout pants. When it's really cold out and I don't wanna wear shorts even in the gym, because it's cold inside the gym, I will wear my John G pants. I think they're based out of Boston, Massachusetts. Oh my goodness, they're obviously getting ready for summer because, oh wow. Thank you, John G. Thank you, thank you. Okay, moving on. I will give these guys a quick shout out. I am really enjoying Bix as my electrolyte rehydration company. Basically, you drop one of these tablets. You've seen, I filmed it up in Leadville, I remember. Uh, Bix, there it is. And I think they're based maybe in Arizona. I don't know, tastes good. I feel good afterward. It's an electrolyte hydration mix. For SJD shoe giveaways, Nike Peg 36, Men's 7, in a Solomon box, but they are not Solomons, the Peg 37, size 7. These will be for the next running shoe giveaway. What is next here? Okay, I'm gonna save this one. This one looks like it's from outside the United States. Most. Let's see here. Oh, it's a buff. It is a buff. It's I, Seth, please find and close a little something for you. True love from uh, 10B Wales. Shout out to everybody in Wales, the Iron Man town of the UK. We enjoy your channel as we exercise each evening. Keep up the good work as you both inspire us. Love your little family. Uh, little in size, not in numbers. Uh, and that is correct. Nicola, I think it's Nicola and Cartha. Thank you so much. I do appreciate it all. Oh, and it's a little Welsh there at the end. Attention, Seth James Damore from Hong Kong. Nice, stormy. Happy holiday, Merry Christmas, and Happy New Year. Oh, this is awesome. This must be somebody's dog. <laughs> That's awesome. Happy New Year to you as well. <laughs> Thank you so much for your videos and the love you are sharing with all of us. I wanted to share with you one of my favorite shoes, the Kiprun KS Lite from the French franchise Decathlon. Wow, I have definitely never tried out. I've heard of this company, but I've never tried out. The only, he said, it says at the end here, size nine. I hope these are not size nine because that is not my size. Hold on, you at, ooh. These, oh, I'm a size seven and a half. Looks like these might be a size nine. Who out there, not the question of the day, who has raced or trained, I should say, in the company Decathlon. I've heard of this company, but I've never tried them before. Let us know down in the comments. Lots of shoes here. These are from Nick in Indiana. Thank you, Nick. He says, I messaged you a couple weeks ago about donating some of my shoes to the DGR community or any runner for that matter. And here they are. Spikes and brand are brand new, worn for one short workout. That is awesome. Um, Wow, and then he says, uh, put a kid's club shirt in for the fam too. Let's see this, a shirt. I always, I always like good shirts. Oh, shout out to Indiana, the Hoosiers. Good mail time, solid mail time. She's crushing it out in the snow. Good job, my love, getting the workout in. Getting the workout in. Here you go, true love. I brought you a warm coat. Oh, let's it's go. It's cold, let's baby, go. it's cold outside. Oh, yeah, right? Oh, things are bringing me this. By the way, what do you think of the new Bronco? It's cold. Oh, babies. Oh, babies, it's cold out there. Oh, baby, it's cold out there. Oh, good job. Okay. Okay. So, we've been married almost 10 years. That's right. And we've been going on date nights for over 10 years, That's every right. Tuesday. And never have we ever walked out of a place. And yeah. I'm not I'm not even gonna mention the name and what yeah. happened. Yeah. Bottom line, it did this is how the day has gone. It was not what it, it we was, expected. It was not what we expected. P paid a pretty pay anyway. All guys, Water and also, you know us, we're pretty positive patient people. There was like four fails. There's like we four like, issues. Well, that's it, we gotta go. We're going somewhere else. We love you. Question of the day. <laughs>
I was thinking about this on the run as the run, the run was uh, downhill. Going down. It's a downhill kind of day, babies. What is a movie or Ooh. sitcom ending that you wish didn't end the way it ended? Lost. Lost. Oh, you know what you did. Remember Lost. So we love you guys. Thanks for being here. That's the question That's of the day. That's a great question. Is that a good one? Yeah. So. Unlike the salad I just tried oh, to eat in man. there. Oh, and all right. We love you. Seek beauty. Work hard. Actually, I forgot to toss it back. Oh, let's toss it back to a good day. How about we'll Ocean back. Prime Night? Valentine's Ocean Prime Day. Valentine's. Back to better days. If you want to see, if you want to see a good <laughs> date night, go go here, go here, go here. All right. We love you. Seek beauty. Work hard and love, love each other. other. We'll see, see you tomorrow. tomorrow. That is a great question. Right? Lost I want to know. Lost is a good one.